Yo, what's up guys here, GTA Pups here, and welcome back to another brand new GTA 5 video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about on how or what if we add mansions in GTA 5 Online as part of, a, you know, an upcoming DLC or whatnot, and actually what it would look like on how you would actually be buying it, you know, on the different websites and such like that, looking at, uh, you know, fan-made screenshots and whatnot. So let's get right in to today's video. So yes, guys, I know a lot of people, you know, want mansions in it, you know, a GTA 5 update, and we still haven't got mansions yet. And again, GTA 5 itself is almost, you know, 10 years old, and it's unbelievable that we still don't have mansions in the game. Well, a Twitter handler named actually the Diamond Casino and Resort on Twitter actually made some fan-made concepts on how it would look like if we were actually buying it, you know, on the Dynasty 8 real estate site. And these are basically like fan-made, you know, wallpapers if you were like going online and you know looking through the photos and you know clicking on the link to find out more again these are what these images are and he actually made two concepts that we are actually going to be looking at in today's video but actually let's look at the first one and that is the Devin Weston's mansion that you could possibly be by in GTA 5 online so again, this is what it looks like if you are actually wanting to look at more photos. Again, it says Dynasty 8 Real Estate, Devin Weston's Mansion, and he thinks it would be around $4.800 million. And again, as I love how it says learn more or buy. Again, these concepts are really nice. And again, it has a great overview of what the property would look like. Again, the mountains in the... Uh, you know, the background, got the roads, we got this whole mansion, the pool, you know, on whatnot. And, uh, you know, great angle of what these, you know, property would look like. Now, let's actually take a look at the first image that he provided us. And it's basically the outback of the property. And again, who knows on how Rockstar would actually do these properties. Would there actually be a business a part of the mansion update? I would probably think so. Again, the history of what Rockstar has with our updates here. They usually put a business though. But what if you were actually wanted to relax by the pool here? Again, I would think Rockstar would have to put an invisible, you know, bubble around this mansion so we don't have like any uh, you know, aircrafts that can shoot missiles at you. Again, we would have people coming in at the you know, presser mark too. So again, I would have to think Rockstar would make this a family-friendly, you know, mansion type of atmosphere. And I would think Rockstar would do that because, again, you would probably have the community, you know, having an uproar that they cannot enjoy their mansion without having, you know, gunshots or missiles coming after them. So again... I would think they would do that. So again, this is a great image of basically, the, you know, the, the sunny skies, uh, no clouds in sight, maybe just a couple, but again, the backyard of the Devon Weston Mansion. The next image we have here, he's basically showing off of, you know, the front of the property. Again, having that long driveway. Now, who knows on how Rockstar would have it would be kind of great maybe to have like where you have to ring the fence and like you maybe have to be in a you know type of crew or be friends maybe on PlayStation or Xbox to be invited to this mansion. Again, not in the everyday world where you have me recording this video going to Drake's mansion. Again, you have to have, you know, top-notch security. Uh, you know, guards guarding this. So again, it would seem to me on how Rockstar would end up doing such a thing if you did own a mansion. Because again, you're spending a lot of money for this mansion. And your Rockstar is probably going to implement something that you have to buy in order to have security. But again, who knows on how they would do such a thing. And then the next image is again a nightlife view at the pool with maybe on a model or your GTA character standing there in the uh, ad. 
So I would love to see some, you know, pool parties implemented into these mansions. Again, a lot of mansions in real life in GTA 5 Online have pools. And again, you're not just going to sit there and have a drink and just hit a button to have an animation at a pool. I wish we could have like some DJs at this pool. Maybe implement their music feature that Rockstar loves. But again, ultimately have some pool parties and just have different features to have fun at this mansion and not to make boring. Like probably what Rockstar would ultimately do is probably have you buy this mansion and you'll basically not be using it for anything except their business. So again, that is cool. Now Rockstar or uh, you know Diamond Casino and Resort brought out another type of property because people were asking for a beach house property that you could actually buy on Lenny Avery Realty. And as you can see, here's what this beach house property would actually look like. Nothing special on any way. Again, it has uh, you know, three car garage and this would probably be for like 1.1 million dollars and again it's something that not too expensive but a property that you would want to have on you know the coastal highway area of that sort of livery maybe not you know have a mansion you know downtown los santos maybe you know on the outskirts of it again some people like to have different properties and as you can see this is not your typical uh beach house mansion it, you know it's a uh you know standing on stilts and maybe what Rockstar could actually do is implement some hurricane features or some bad weather that this, you know, mansion has to, you know, take. Again, just because it's on the beach doesn't mean it's typically you're buying this for the view. Sometimes, you know, you have some weather revolve. Or maybe you can actually, if it's going to be, you know, a bad mansion like this, you know, with the paints, maybe you can, you know, change the customizations and, and you know, get it reconstructed into a better looking beach house mansion to have like your friends over and things like that so again i think that is cool as well and also here's your last image of this what it's looking at is basically having a vehicle out there and usually these beach houses have like different boats or jet skis a part of it you know you're on the ocean uh you know maybe have like a dock or something again rocks are could implement it just not have this mansion that you're you know just living in again for both of these mansions i do believe rockstar has to have a lot of great features involved and in different businesses and stuff like that to make this dlc or update very exciting for players if and when they do a mansion update and again i know probably people have petitions out there and i know there's some you know mod uh mansions that you can see in this gameplay that you're seeing now so again there are mansion mods that people you know are doing on pc but it's just rockstar didn't bring out their own update own mansion thing but again i want to hear from you guys in this comment section down below what are you willing to pay for these mansions? Are you willing to pay below a million or, you know, upper millions, maybe even tens of millions of dollars? Again, I wonder from you guys in those comments section down below. So again, guys, if you did enjoy today's video, a like rating would be super awesome. Remember to subscribe to the GTA Pubster channel for more videos like this. Again, my name is Puppy here, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.